I said before it's like groundhog day uh it just uh every day is a kind of just a replay just try to make each one a little bit different a little bit more interesting and everything it's uh raining in la uh it was 
it was just warm and beautiful the other day and I have patio furniture and I took all the covers off of it and, and uh, um, tucked everything away, got it all nice and all of a sudden they said, it's gonna rain for a week. So everything came back out and had a, it rained overnight and then I uh, just took the boys out. We had a little respite from it and I just took the boys for a nice walk. Um, got some poops out and uh, not me, the dogs. And, um, and now everything's back and the sky is like turning dark, dark gray. So it's supposed to really hit tonight. Um, but um, when I finished uh, yesterday uh, on, on the last song, um, I said it ends on a bop and then there's a fill going right into the next song. So there was no space. So actually um, on the board mix, uh, the song I'm doing today has the end of the last song. So you'll hear how we did it. Um, but today we do Dance Into the Light, and uh, it was really a fun song to play. Everybody just kicked butt on it, and it was a, a joy. So again, again, thinking about everybody out there, what you're dealing with, what we're all dealing with, um, it's uh, it's tough. I mean, people are really getting uh, some cabin fever and, and a little bit nuts with uh, being sequestered, but it's the smartest thing you can do is to stay indoors, just go out. If you have to get groceries or, or, you know, pharmaceuticals, anything like that, if you have to get your medicine or anything of importance for your survival, go out. But if not, don't go out. Let's try to get this thing uh, behind us. Uh, it's But when I see all these videos of people gathering in big groups, uh, it's, it's just so sad because it's such an ignorant thing to do and you're going to cause a lot of misery by doing this. So be as smart as you possibly can and just take it easy. Um, find something to do around the house. I got, I've got a closet I just tore apart and I'm, I'm working at that. I mean, you, wow, it's insane. So uh, enough of my nonsense here. And uh, in one of my videos the other day, I said a couple of swear words and somebody came at me and I just like, so disappointed in me and there's kids watching this stuff and and stuff and I go hey you know I'm sorry about that <laughs> you know I mean I am me and this is the way I am and uh, I'm sorry that that that, that it hits your sensitive button um, but I think a couple of swear words are like the least problem we're facing at this time in in life so um, I'll try to be cool uh, can't guarantee anything because I generally speak before I think Oh, geez, I could be a politician. Hmm. Um, but let's do Dance Into the Light. This is a lot of fun. So here, oops, I almost turned this off. Let me get that one.
into the light and uh, looking out the window and there's not much light to dance into so I'm going to stick around here so you guys take good care have a great day today as best you can I always hate saying that I'm trying to keep be positive and uplifting but I know for a lot of people it's a very difficult day especially the um, all the healthcare people um, every day I see more and more um, issues going on for them the, the lack of supplies um, the you know, lack of leadership and getting anything accomplished. They're really having to, they've been really left out on their own to save people's lives. And they're doing a remarkable job under the circumstances. But my heart's really with all the families that are suffering loss and, and, and illness at this point. So everybody just uh, take care as best you can. And I will see you tomorrow. And I think uh, tomorrow we might be visiting Genesis again. So take good care. I will talk to you then. Bye-bye.